Greetings and salutations, everybody. My name is Michael Schwann. Today is 
a day of the week. It's Thursday, January 25th, 2024. We're going to be playing some more Lines of P. Hello, Joshipi. Hello, Cerulean. Hello, Rayback. Welcome in. Thank you so much. This is a heads up to everyone um, because it's only been doing this for about a week now. Um, there was an ad that was ran during that intro video. Um, and there's going to be a short ad that runs every about 30 minutes or so. We do this to uh, invalidate pre-rolls because pre-rolls pre suck worse than mid-rolls immensely on twitch on twitch on youtube i'd rather pre-rolls than mid-rolls but on twitch pre-rolls i find to be awful and atrocious and twitch isn't giving us much of an option that said twitch just did announce some changes uh that are going to be coming in may i want to say of uh, affiliates will be able to get into the plus program uh to where you can earn more money for your subs uh because it's right now it's like 50 50 they were doing a test run of the Partner Plus program. You had to be a partner. And if you got over 350 sub points in a month for three months straight, then you would be upgraded to a 70-30 split uh, for the next 12 months up to uh, $100,000 a year. And they just changed that to, well, they're they're going to change it to a just a plus program that affiliates will also be available to be able to get into, which if you had 100 points a month, for three months, you will get into tier one plus, which is 60-40 split. And if you hit 300 a month, 300 points a month for three months, you get into the 70-30 split with no cap and it doesn't require you to be partner, which is really, really cool. Um, I don't foresee us shooting for that, at least not in the, not uh, not right now anyway. Uh, so we'll see how that goes in the future though. That's really cool that they're doing that. I think that's a really good opportunity for a lot of people. Uh, and we'll talk about that more on Sunday when we get to production day because i do want to talk about it does it need to be 100 unique subs or do gifted subs sound gifted subs count uh any sub of any kind even prime subs count uh and the way that it works is it's if it's tier one or prime that is one sub point if it is tier two that is worth two points and if it's tier three it is worth six points which i think is really interesting because that was one of like sorry one of the weird things that I always felt with Twitch is it never felt like tier two or tier three subs were beneficial in any way. Because like, if you got a tier one, like you would all, there, you didn't gain anything from a higher tier sub as the creator. And even the subscriber, at most they would get maybe higher gratification from the streamer or they would get like, um, like a, an emote or two right but it was still cut 50 50 and i was like man why if twitch can pay out two dollars and fifty cents or upwards of three dollars and whatever that amount is is it 350 what is 75 percent of five if half is 250 375 is what 70 no that's 75 percent so yeah like 350 um, which means that they can still earn money off of that dollar fifty to two fifty. Why then, on a tier three sub that's twenty five dollars, do they still take twelve fifty of it? Why didn't they always just take whatever they took before and give the creator the rest? Right? Like, take take your two fifty and give the streamer twenty two fifty. Because if the 250 is worth it for Twitch for a tier one, why do they take 1250 of a tier three? I never understood that at all. And even now, it'll still be not as good <laughs> in terms of the amount that goes to the streamer versus the amount that goes to Twitch. Because even if you get to 70%, you, you're still gonna be taking like 20 bucks no, you still get like 20 bucks versus 20, you, you, uh, math. I'm, I'm not here to do math. But tier threes do have a benefit now moving forward of they a single tier three is worth more sub points than five tier ones. Because before there wasn't a value in them, right? Because it was like, well, five tier ones give you $12.50 worth of months because 250 each and a tier three would give you twelve dollars and fifty cents five tier ones are worth five sub points but a tier three is worth six 
So there is a small, teeny tiny little benefit to tier threes of if you are supporting a creator that is trying to get into the plus program, uh, whether they're trying to get 100 points a month or 300 points a month, uh, your tier three is worth an extra point compared to gifting five subs, which is a s small benefit that, it, that does exist that didn't exist before. Well, we can talk about that more on Sunday. Today, today we're here to lie. Not true, actually. Uh, we've been doing the exact opposite of that in Lies of P. Every single time we have the opportunity to tell the truth, we have been. Outside of when the game forced us to lie uh, the very first time. The game does force you to lie the first time it gives you the ability to make a decision because there's no way to progress, at least as far as we could tell. There was no way to progress that didn't involve lying. All right. Let's hope the controller is working today. Hmm. It wasn't working the other day. Shh. Calm down. <laughs> that took me so long, Cerulean. I was like, math, math, ma ticks, math, ma ticks, math, 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 mathematics. We're playing freaking apples to apples over here, whatever that game is. Okay, what were we doing? It's been like six days. We just beat the one guy. Was that. Was that cute Bulbasaur, your desktop background? It was. It is a live wallpaper, courteous of Wallpaper Engine on Steam for $4. It was one of the best $4 I ever spent. It's raining! Please, sir, may I have some more? Thank you. Stalker, please. If you pick some gold coin fruit for Yeah, I know. Can I just give these to you? I had really rat can I just buy as many of these up that I want? Pretty much. Can I just give then I just I just I'd really rather just give these to you. Okay, well. I don't know if there's a point where we're supposed to give him enough of those to, like, save his life. I don't know. <laughs> oh, man. So, Sheepy, I, I had to, like, make the emote bigger that you put in of It's So Precious because I couldn't quite, without knowing what it was, I couldn't tell what it was just by looking at it. And so I was like, is that, like, a really interesting rendition of Bulbasaur? In a, sort of, but it looked like Bulbasaur's head. Because it was a weird shape and I couldn't see that it was somebody laying down crying. Because I was like, I don't know what that is. Where are we going? There's a bunch of people here that want to talk to us. At the house of Vanini, even priceless things have a price. Every item is a treasure of distinguished quality and superior provenance. Master Vanini carefully curated this collection box himself. With it, you have returned to us what was stolen. You have our gratitude. The House of Vanini always keeps a few special items in the private reserve, sir. Only for our more discerning patrons, of course. At the House of Vanini. What do you sell now? Sells a weapon. 
Oh, some unique grindstones. Enhances guard performance. Interesting, really. Huh. What else is in here? Cranks to adjust weapons if we wanted. Some new equipment doodads. What is... Increases critical hit chance temporarily. Huh. Oh, mm. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Whoa. Calm down. Okay, so this how do how do I know which one we're I think this is the one we're wearing. Four, six and a half, five. So we haven't upgraded that in a long time. Increases damage inflicted on carcasses. Isn't everyone in this game practically a carcass? Ah, ah, ah. At the house of a... Do I have any collectibles? No. Hello. Ah, I heard you defeated the king of puppets. Amazing. I did. Ah, the puppets appear lost without their leader. They have no purpose, no focus. To think one can have so much control through ergo waves. If we don't determine who or what is causing it, this could all happen again tomorrow. I fear I must call upon you again, my friend. Please gather records of the puppet's ergo waves while you're defeating them. Yep, yep, yep. Modify. Can we make this thing stronger now? Oh, it just costs the thing. It doesn't cost the same material. Interesting. Now oh, we need more to do that. How do I do a counter charge? I need more Legion calipers anyway. So we can just craft another one of these. I'm just gonna craft this one for the sake of it not glowing anymore. Oh, you still glow. That's good. Okay. Well, excuse me for trying. I know my way around. I don't think we can upgrade this. No, we need a half moon stone to upgrade it further. This is a dagger handle. Stab an enemy in front of you and quickly move backwards. I wonder if the dagger handle that he sells for this tyrant blade. I wonder if it has the same attack pattern. A quick forward stab. It doesn't sound a whole lot better. Motivity technique, DB. What is what is our current? Motivity technique, DCB. Okay, so. We have more value in advance than technique, but the blade, oh, it's all in the handle. Motivity DC, wait, DCB. I don't think we have that many points in it in advance though. No, our advanced stats terrible. We got a whole bunch of points in technique. I know my way around. So wouldn't it be better if we changed this to where Alter handle. Wouldn't it be better if we change this to be a technique blade? Yeah, we'd get an extra 10 damage out of it. Why we got so many points in technique? Why didn't we put points in advance? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, 
Yeah, we got some more damage in our main weapon that we use. All right, who else wants to talk? Daddy? I think Daddy wanted to talk. Father! My father will be hearing about this. I don't know what he's hearing about, but I'm sure he'll tell me. Excuse me, Geppetto. I would like to speak with you. You don't remember much beyond Rosa Isabel Street, do you? I don't remember anything, dude. Ask me about areas you want to know about. Um, we'll just go down the list. What's up with the Grand Exhibition? We plan to reveal our new automated puppet technology at the Grand Exhibition. If it hadn't been canceled, it would have shocked the world. The alchemists are there now, working on a cure for the petrification disease. Dare we hope? In my experience, they always have an ulterior motive. Remember to be on your guard when you're with them. Uh, Baron Swamp. The Baron Swamp was originally vacant, useless land. It became a massive dumping ground when the factory started disposing of puppets. The polluted groundwater spawned strange creatures. Hmm. Perhaps similar to the ones in the cathedral. Definitely worth an investigation. And rumors whisper of rare treasure in a monster's nest. Why don't you go look for it, son? Krat Central Station. Krat Central Station. Yes, it's where you woke up. There used to be a workshop near the station. However, the puppets destroyed it when they attack. Many of the puppets have moved on, but now strange monsters lurk nearby. Be careful if you go back. You're precious to me. And the headquarters? People call them the alchemists of the isle. Their headquarters must be on an island across the sea, but it's not on any chart. Sounds like DLC. I remember tales of an underground dock and crop where the alchemists would embark. That's all I know. Okay. Okay, I think that that's now everyone. Let me see if there's any icons left on this. Uh, okay, yes. Where'd he go? He left us a note, but I don't remember what the note said anymore. Let's talk to her first. Oh. Oh, it's you. Come closer, won't you? When you reach a certain age, it's a comfort to reflect on old memories. That's a portrait of me when I was young. <laughs> you were rich as fuck. I was so feisty, so fierce back then. I loved the world, and the world loved me back. The passion of those days is long gone. But I still dream of those memories. I'm curious what your young eyes see. Is there any resemblance between me and that portrait? I still have of course. No. <laughs> it seems Dupetto even taught you good manners. Yes, those Beautiful memories are still vivid in my mind. Time. Time and the memories that fill it are all we have. I hope you're making some good memories of your own. It may be a comfort to you someday. The fuck did that mean? The ergo is whispering. Was that technically that? That book reminds all. You know, was that some, did was that technically a lie just now? Like that was a very subjective thing. 
Um, uh, Paul Lieutenant or whatever your name is. Where'd you go? Holly Shore. Please come to the hotel garden on the way to Elysian Boulevard. Where's, where's that? Is that out here? Yes. Welcome, good sir. Paul and Dina. At last, we speak frankly instead of with professional reserve. I have something to confess. Something involving your unique perspective. Okay. I am a puppet whose ego has awoken. I don't know exactly why, and we need not dwell on the details. Instead, I wish to dwell on the welfare of Lady Antonia. I adore Lady Antonia. It is a presumptuous feeling for a puppet to have, to be sure. I have no intention of putting myself forward, of course. However, I cannot watch her die. It's too painful. Thus, I need your unique perspective. You exist somewhere between human and puppet. Can a puppet and a human fall in love? Have you ever met a puppet who loves a human? I don't know. It exists indeed. An unbelievable love, to be sure. I have no intention of telling her, of course. It wouldn't be proper to burden someone so frail. If I may be frank, this is better than I dared hope. Even if you are telling me a sweet lie, I shall savor it. Thank you. It was wise to confide in you. Thank you for granting me that wisdom. Huh. I have no idea. Because I was like, well, I feel like we care a lot about people. But I don't know if we necessarily count as a puppet. Sort of. Technically, we are. Where the fuck are we supposed to go now? Okay, that's everything. So we can actually move on now. Right? Was there anything else that we needed to do here? Yes. When we walked through the back, we ran into Geppetto. Didn't we? When they're back here? Yeah. This is where we ran into Geppetto. It was right here. Can we continue forth from this location? Tally forth. I was going to backstab him, but I forgot how to play the game. The fuck is that? Is that a dog with an... Yes, that was in fact a dog with an axe for a head. She should not be going. She she should be going forth, not tally. No, no, we tally forth. 
Sally's a hoe. <laughs> sorry. sorry to any Sally's out there. Night, Eve. And that seems weird. That's weird, right? Yeah, that's weird. It's probably because we killed their god, father, boss, master. I don't know. Special individual. We killed Romeo. Love is dead. Up we go versus down. Attribute purification ampule. What does that do? Oh, okay. King dead, they they seem lost. Maybe they are. And again, maybe maybe they're mourning him? Could be. Whatever's happening. It's like they can't tell their elbow joint from their tail sockets. I'm not even sure they can function without the king to guide them. Don't worry about that right now, Gemini. They still try to kill us if they notice us. It's good enough for me right now, okay? That thing is tweaking. Three minute warning on the first ad break, everybody. Oh, you know I'm here. Can I do the shield move? I played too much, too much, much Monster Hunter between playing this and playing uh, this. <laughs> I'm so good with words, man. No. Oh. That's right. I've had a weird day all day today. I've been super super off of everything when it came to like energy and ability to focus and energy that's that's been a real big one it's not had any more passion more passion more energy more energy more passion, more energy, passion.
It's alright, we'll just move a little bit quicker in getting back to where we were, because I was kind of, you know, being being a bit cautious about it on the way there. I wasn't sure what we were going to run into, so didn't want to get, you know, overzealous and sprint into our deaths. Alright, we got it. Goodbye. Good talk. Glad we had glad we had this discussion. What's up here? Friends. Goodbye, friend. Friend. Bye, friend. Those aren't friends. Sure they are. I gave him a nice, strong pat on the back. Now where are we? Hey, the Lorenzini Arcade. Yeah, one of those corporate hats. A lot of dudes. Shit. All right, I think that's most everyone. Oh. Welcome back, everybody. This is the uh, the Lorenzini Arcade, where we're supposed to get somebody. Some wine from the basement. You guys haven't changed. Ew, what the fuck is that? That's disgusting. was not friendly nor was he friend shaped he just wanted to put his gross pincer thing into me
All right. That opens from the other side. There's also a door over there that opens from the other side. We got two directions. We'll move away from the big important looking door first. Ew! You're disgusting. Oh God. Here, touch this. Oh God, I'm dying. He was like exploding with gross nasty. Man, I really need to heal my, not heal, I really need to upgrade my ampule thing somehow so that it heals for more because it's just not healing for very much. I don't think I can open this door. I need a key. Lorenzini first floor arcade key. Okay. Very well. My controller just stopped responding. That's good. Hello? Like the game clearly still works. The mouse and keyboard. There we go. Oh, let's hope that doesn't start happening often. <gasps> Sounds like a good way to lose a boss fight, you know? I don't think we can open this one either. Ew! H2. All right. Well, here's a question. We're going to go level up and we're going to see if that dude respawns every single time that we use the stargazer. If that big gross dude respawns every time, that's going to suck. The portrait hanging in Geppetto's room. It looks very much like you. It does, which is odd, right? I sense something strange. Something like the changes you're going through. The sort of thing you'd read in a fairy tale. Go to Geppetto's room. You should see it for yourself. Okay. Go back. I was so worried when you marched off to fight the king. But this, it's a necklace from the Mona Charity House. They took care of orphans and impoverished children from across Krat. Many of those children grew up at the Rose Estate and became alchemists, technicians, and stalkers. I hope the king didn't harm any of them. Or don't tell me. The king's ergo is actually... Are you okay? You look ill ever since I mentioned the necklace. My heavens, you look... What the fuck just happened? You're changing. Your 
are becoming something more than a puppet. Almost human. Our hair grew. If this is what you want, just keep behaving. Keep feeling like a human does. You might just hold the true secret of Ergo. Look at our boy. He's even prettier now. All right, she said go look at the portrait in Geppetto's room. Did we get taller? Oh. Well, at some point we did lie, I guess. Maybe we lied to both Antonia and to Paul and Dina. I did not mean to. One was a subjective question. I'll use my power. So what you do is you lie enough that your nose gets long enough that you can use it as a pull-up bar. Let's get some more HP. All right, let's see if big and ugly respawned. Which direction was he? This way? Enjoyed that. Mm. Is this the key we need? It is. Oh. Or maybe, maybe you were supposed to lie to become a human. Because humans lie, puppets don't. Yeah, you're gross. Yo, Gemini, what's up? Ew, gross. Oh, that's not what I expected you to do. Let go. Oh. Ew. He drank me like he's freaking Cell from Dragon Ball. That's also gross. Hate that sound. Oh God, that's like... Ew! Uh, ew! Some stars die out and burn with passion.
That looks like a terrible room over there. I see like multiple big things in a room full of gross nasty. Butterfly near a butterfly nearby, Gemini. I think I heard it. Ow! What did it drop? Nothing? Weird. Jerk. Star fragment. Hmm. This sucks. Well, at least this water don't hurt me. Oh. gonna abuse the shit out of this wall. Couldn't see. He's mean. I don't even really know where I'm trying to get to. Although I think that's the room where we're gonna find the bottle of wine that the one chick wants. Because there's the, what, 
there's the woman that's in the window that had asked for some of the, the wine that she used to remember that she could only get from... Ow. From here. Get away from me. Fucking camera. <laughs> Jesus. caught on all the posts and shit. Yep, I was like, I'm too close. I'm not going to be able to get out of the way of that one. Oh, the hardest boss in video games is the camera. I need to be able to see myself and him to be able to, like, respond with blocks and parries. And it's real hard if I can't see one of those two things. Uh, away from the big door. Ultimate boss. Yep, the camera boss and uppercuts. The uppercut one is definitely just more for me than, than everyone, but... Ew! Stop it, you nasty. Oh. She dropped a bobble. Mamu, I've come to bargain. suck He's like I'm pretty sure you're the one getting your ass beat right now Cut off his baiting arm. All right. There's one of her bottles that she wants here. Um, 
I would assume so, but the question is, where is it? The whole place is flooded with broken wine barrels, but where's the little doodad she wanted? Glad you're not human yet, Pinocchio. You'd be getting drunk just off of the smell. I did not see anything that was like pick upable in there. What did we get? Is it like a, a key item? It looks like a Love that sound. Looked like a like a cog wheel almost. Like like not a cog wheel, like something that you use to to turn like a music box. I don't see anything like that in here. Oh, we did get a half moon stone at some point. We can upgrade our sword again. Defense parts. Oh, it was this. Okay, I see. The little cogwheel is up there. The type of item that it was is up there. But it was a ring. Increase our defense a bit. Okay. Take one more look in the basement for the, the thingy ma bobber. Which I do not see. Well, there might be more basement, so keep going. Also need a key. Arcade underground passage key. Oh, good. Yep, that is just decay gas. Awesome. That sucks. Whoa. Oh no. Oh god, ew, fucking fucking ew, gross. Okay. I need to get around the big dude and see if there's a shortcut over there somewhere. There probably is. Oh, I thought he was about to turn down here and I was like, we're screwed. There's fucking two of them. There's fucking two of them. There's fucking two of them. Um. Uh, fuck. Yeah, go back that way, big boy. Does that guy see me? Is that why he started walking down this hallway? Is he coming to get me? Okay, 
Okay, running around him. Looking for our door. Oh! Please don't be too many things in here. the door that reconnects the circle. I won't, I want to fight the big guys, but I don't want to have to run back through everything to do so. Sweet. Perfect, okay. It was like, I'll happily fight those guys. gonna pop too yeah but there's nothing in you okay let's see what these guys are like people in you Your brother's way down there I don't actually have a need to fight both of them I just wanted to fight one of them to see what they were like visitor or a looter who's arrived too late you look like a stalker i figured you were all dead <laughs> no offense stalker visitor looter i don't care just buy what you need and leave how are you getting around you have a weapon you have some fire abrasives increases resistance to Disruption, shock, and break. Why not decay? Why don't you have resistance to decay? I'm sure I'll take your weapon and your accessory. This should just open to the big dude, doesn't it? Yeah. I had to check. I was like, is he coming down here? No. Just 
Still can't go that way. Leads in the horrible no no. Although I think. I think if you run in and beat up that plant, the decay goes away. one little oh oh buddy oh buddy Awfully big room. No oh good, it goes back down. Someone's gonna open these gates. Holy shit, the fuck? Oh, you're awful. Broke one of his weapons. Now I'm gonna break him. Well, you know. Oh, Jesus. That. I didn't expect you to swing that fucking far. Fucking camera boss. Okay. Carnival. Carnival. Yeah. 
All right. Next. Where's that stupid bottle of wine? Another one buzzed through that wall. Son of a bitch. Some wine? You know, like the wine you've got? Mm hmm. She sure is. From where? And how? Was it the stargazer that was ringing? It was. Can you hear me? Really? Aviva, it actually worked. This has to be how the King of Puppets did it. How he called to the puppets and controlled them. I can't believe you can transmit your voice through ergo waves. What a brilliant discovery. And you'll never believe what signal I've picked up over the ergo. A cry for help from the grand exhibition. Somehow someone survived. I'm suspicious too. But you'll have to investigate. What if it's some trapped innocent? Or what if it's bait? All right, where's our lady at? She's over here. I can see her window right there. Let's go pay her a visit. And then go level up. What are you doing, buddy? Ah! It's fine. Everything's fine. a distinctive shade of red. Oh, thank you, young one. Every step is a struggle when you have the petrification disease. But this, this glimmer of happier days is priceless. Oh, why, you almost forgot. They're speaking of price. Here's what I can spare. Please, take it. Thanks. Or somebody cares about that. The butler. from the founding of the Vanini Foundation. The Foundation is a sort of 
fan club, sir. A very limited number of these were minted for the original members. Well, once Master Venini established himself as the <clears throat> Prince of High Society, his popularity skyrocketed, and his signature coat and glasses were mass-produced. Hmm. This is one of the originals, however, from the limited run. Take care of it, won't you? You, you have restored Master Venini's lost collection. You've earned this small token of appreciation, sir. Thank you. Do we get an outfit that is Vanini's clothes? Is that what we just got right now? Alchemist hat. Uh, I guess not. Sure sounded like we did, but definitely didn't. We definitely didn't get goggles or glasses that look like his. Unless they're for sale now. At the house of it. No, not not for sale. We did get a half moon stone, so we can use that to make our weapon I know better. Way around a weapon. This. We actually have two of them. And we need so we were able to level it up once. We need another one to level it up again. At the house of a four, six point six five. Five so this is just flat better. These are all more focused, but this one is just flat better than what we're using. Carcasses, okay, it's a I hate blue blood. So it's anything that's on those creatures that like the ones that are made of decay, it does more damage against them. I'm just gonna buy it for the sake of it. I'm gonna buy these two since we don't have enough to level up. Um, sure, give me all the weapons. Cool. We're fighting a lot of those things, so I'll put one of those on right now. Keep that, because I never used my Fable. Um, and then we got a better one of these, right? Which is better in every way. Ah, oh, we're heavy, though. Shit. Shit. Do we have a lighter secondary weapon? Yes. Honestly, I don't... Can I just... There we go. I was like, can I just make save the weight entirely by just not having a secondary? Because we never switch weapons. And I've put all of my resources into upgrading this, which makes having a secondary weapon feel unnecessary right now. Because it's just going to be strictly worse than what we're using. Now, where do we go in here? We, we're not done in here. I know where we go. We go back into the, the underground passage. If I can remember how to get there. So we're gonna go back underground So that we can. Because there's more rooms down here. Because there's this one, but we can't get to that one. Not right now, anyway.
but we can go that way. So we went that way before. I don't think there's anything else down that way, so. Where's the bulb? They don't stay broken. That's unfortunate. Oh. They regrow after a while. Good to know. Excuse me. All right. If you want to fight, you come out here and fight. I'm not fighting you inside a, a cloud of gross. Oh, of course you leash at the fucking door. Of course he leashes at the door. Why wouldn't he? It's annoying. I don't know what else is down there, but we'll go find out. We at least have that door open now. That'll help. At least you guys don't explode. pretty quick too.
All right. I'm gonna go see if there's anything else down here. Ow. Is this dude beating my ass? safe down here. No weapon in it. Kind of it for there. It was mostly just the safe. Take a look if there's anything else down here. I don't think that there is. What's this way? Another door. This was the entrance. This is how it, this this is the front door. Was the only Was the only thing in here just the bottle of wine? Do I have like a map? I don't think we do. Call any other directions to go. I feel like it all circled around. Feel lost. Rot Central Station Street. Can at least go get that. I think is Central Station Plaza. this place. The 
enemies did not get stronger here. Did we never open that door? Or were we never able to open this door? dude an old guy it is neat that the enemies stay at the same strength level though now didn't actually hurt like at all but hmm Hello? I feel like we're close. Check the ground at the end of the cliff of Krat Central Station Street where there is a good view of the ocean and Krat's lawn marks. like down there I feel like we went the wrong way it's like we're too close I'm just gonna heal for the sake of just being bored not bored but that way Vanini said there was somebody that needed, that was asking for help at the Grand Exhibition, but I don't know where that is. What's up? Hi. It's okay. Welcome home. Um, let's go this way. Looks like it could be promising. Man, I remember this place. We 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 got our ass kicked here a couple of times. So this way is where they want us to go. I see Hotel Cry. I do love this view. It is a nice view, but we must be moving. Did we already get the thing here? This is the spot. How do I like? How do I like do it? Check the ground, the end of the cliff, We're at Station Street, where there's a good view of the ocean and Kratz lawn marks.
Did I already find it? Because I walked it down here before. But I didn't know about this until... Yeah, this is definitely the spot. I just don't think we can find it. Or maybe we already found it. If I just, like, mash the A button... Okay, well, we're going to look a couple things up because we're not getting anywhere at this point because I don't actually know where to go, and I also don't know how to pick up this thing. Lies of P, pick up secrets. There are actually many secret gesture interactions throughout Lies of P, including this one here, which rewards the its home. Oh, okay. I'm supposed to do a gesture here. Oh, fuck would I have known that? How do I even do gestures? What button does gestures? This one? This one. No. 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 Still no. Nope. Where do I even see gestures at? Check ground. There is straight up a gesture here. Now, how do I bring up those options? specific spot it's like right here where does this dude have it at He did it like up against the fence. Okay. Like over here. Yep, there it goes. Okay, so we figured that out. Now, the next question is where in the world do we go next? Um. Grand Exhibition, I guess. Fra starting from the Lorenzini Arcade Stargazer, go straight ahead and take the staircase up. Okay. Let's go back to the Stargazer. The arcade was like twirling in on itself so I must have just missed that particular staircase not that way
Yeah, I was confused that I would need to go back to go forward because for the most part, this game is just like next area, next area, next area. So it's got to be somewhere here. From the arcade stargazer go straight ahead that's awesome spawned me staring at a wall also this new costume is apparently very bloodborne -y. yeah it is very bloodborne -y. That way? Yes. Okay. Progress. exhibition theme was automatic puppets and city of the future the plan was to showcase and demonstrate the most advanced technology in crot but you know the rest you can't hold an exhibition in a city that's fallen into utter chaos no with that attitude the city is an exhibition of a nightmare this game's gorgeous Guy's got some great swords. One down. Covered in oil. Another great swordian. Oh, I would have killed that dog if my sword didn't hit the cart. That's a big boy over there. I saw a big boy, he was tall. Ow. Rude. He's over here somewhere. I saw him. There he is. Look at this legionnaire ass motherfucker. He's about to teach me a lesson. Holy shit. Man, my, my guy, you could take a little more damage. I'm just saying. Holy God, ow. He 
killed me. We knew that was gonna happen, though. <sighs> All right, which way was straight ahead? This way, I think. I'm a little surprised the arcade didn't have any bosses in it. We still have like 11 bosses to go in this game. It's a lot of bosses for how not like how far I feel like we've come. Like, it's wild to me that the Master of Puppets, which largely f was kind of, like, being presented as, like, this is the main, one of the main dudes that's perpetrating all of this, was the halfway mark. Puppy! Bad puppy. I'm gonna go play with a legionnaire again. almost killed me wait I healed twice but I definitely didn't get two heals out of that I don't have the HP to play with you more than what I just did. So if you want to kill me, follow me up the stairs where I'm sure there's not a way to go besides up here. So there's just another one up here. And he's like, well, hey, hey, what are you doing up here? And I'm like, oh, oh, uh, I was running away from your friend. But now I guess I'm just dying to you. It's just a platform and there's two of them up here. Got on the gondola. This way, when we die, our souls are nice and far away from where we respawn at. is that okay
Yeah, I had a feeling of that. Why are you covered in saws? Oh, Jesus. Yeah, you're sure it's safe, Athena? He was going to be a worker robot. I'm sure that's what his primary purpose was. Look, I can drill away rocks and I can cut away trees with the same robot. Definitely not meant to impale and dismember humans. Why would you think that? You know, Vanini, Geppetto, I feel like we need to have a conversation about, like, some of the shit you guys built. Because I fought that thing, too. And that thing sucked ass. Look at this giant bipedal robot that's clearly meant just to knock down buildings and nothing else. Oh, Jesus. You, murder bot. Broken, broken into a whole bunch of pieces. Hello there. All kinds of secrets laying around. Little goodies for me. I hear the blare of the propaganda outside. Why is there three of you? Ow. Jesus! Sir! Where the fuck did you come from? Oh, this is annoying. You sure we're supposed to go this way? Wait over there for a second, okay? There's no way that running down this ends badly for me, right? I see a door we can open from this side. What's up, Biggie? Hold on just a moment. Mm. 
Yeah, yeah. It's great, buddy. I love that for you. What is up? Swordsman. All right. This is bullshit. Just just climb over that, Pinocchio. Just just step on this railing and step over onto that one carefully. It'll be okay. What the fuck, man? Yeah, okay. Clearly. Where am I going? Okay, well that's helpful. I think. Maybe. Hear a lovely saw sound. And hey, look, it's those horrible monsters. what I thought. I was like, is he going to break through there? I guess not, because I walked around, and after I started fighting his friend, then he broke through and just shoved both his long pointy things straight into my booty. I was trying to figure out how to get to that. Thank <laughs> you. 
Why won't you change the camera? Like, I was trying to change the camera to look at him, and it just wouldn't. Unfortunately, we have to go this way. I really don't want to because there's three of the throwy dudes here plus the shield bro. Oh. Wow. They almost killed us. Okay. you're working your way through i see so after a little bit of time you should punch through because you're oh jesus hello gentlemen where the fuck did you all come from can you come up the stairs yes was all of that shit my weapon also hit like everything all right well at least i got my souls into a slightly easier to recover location i need to go in there and kill those swordsmen before he breaks through apparently because those two swordsmen made that even more difficult than i was hoping it would be You're going down there. Fuck. Okay. that sucks the most. Shit. No, 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 no. All right. Come over here. Pick these back up. Go down here. They came from over here somewhere. Somewhere. There's one of them. Oh, 
Okay. Got rid of those. We just need to kill you. Kill you. Please never fucking do that again. Gross. All right. Got through all of that. We can pick up our loot now. And then we can proceed into the next room while being completely out of healing. And hopefully, we can open up the next shortcut soon. Fuck are you? Another fine day in the city of Krog. But I wonder, my friend, just where you've been? Ah. Oh. <laughs> if your goal is to study the human condition, there's no better way than my riddle position. You know how it is. It's time for a quiz. Sure. Okay. Answer correctly or tango with danger, but when you quiz with the king, danger's no stranger. Now, listen closely and heed the king's speech, or the answer to this one will stay out of reach. Think about this. Whatever it takes. What cannot be used before it breaks? An egg. Correct! You were once such a fool, yet you've gotten so glower. I'm as happy as a parent. In this city, there are those who wish to crack the shell and be reborn. How about you? Can you awaken and break free of the shell that is your puppet spotty? Find out. Interesting. Oh. Alright, you guys are real squishy. That's nice. Can I break these? I can. I don't know if it's a good thing to break these.
Where's my shortcut? We're getting closer to it. I know we are. I just don't want to have to fight through all of this again. Say that it has been a pain is an uh, understatement. Isn't where we came in. Isn't it? Where's this where we came in? This is where we came in. What's this door? It's a horrible sound. I don't... Th you look like one of those elites that I don't want to play with right this minute. I will remember you're there, but I really need to figure out where to kick down the kick down that ladder first. And you aren't it. Or to find another stargazer. I don't care which one. Nope. I bet that dude's got the key. Bet you that guy's got the key. Hmm. Me make sure that this elite isn't on the shortcut. think so we just have a lot of ergo and I don't want to lose it right now especially when the run to get where we're at is it's honestly really obnoxious Feeds back here. Hmm. Feel like that shortcut should be like right here. It's not. Like, on the other side of this wall. The shortcut I'm thinking of is down there. must be on the other side of this courtyard wonder if it's just another way in the room I could really use a stargazer that I really don't like because like I'm I'm decent but I'm not confident enough that I believe that I'm just gonna be able to just strong man my way through all this shit Some of this shit's brutal. Especially the big robots. Man, I do not see a stargazer. It sucks. I'm sure I didn't miss anything anywhere. I think we gotta beat the brute to get the key to open the door that will actually give us. Ow. Well, we 
beat you, but it did use the heal, and I'm only halfway charged up to another one. No one knows when the inorganic cluster structure called Crowd sunk its roots into Krat. The first documented record is 600 years ago when there was a ground collapse in the west of Krat. People collected the bodies of the farmers and mules who died, found unknown minerals and ruins at the bottom of the pit, but they didn't know their value at the time. After the alchemists of the isle settled down, the Devil's Pit, known as the Relic of Trismescus, Trismegistus, was revealed to be an ergo mine of tremendous value. Until then, Crowd was deemed a mere stalagmite with ergo components, so it was nothing special. Unlike ergo, it doesn't have power, it's difficult to process, and absorbs precious ergo spores, so it was more of a hassle. However, after the spread of the petrification of these, things suddenly changed when Crowd grew exponentially to be a threat to the foundation of the city. Even now, Crowd is growing, so early to hypothesize, but I wonder if Crowd is some mineral life that consumes ergo. How else can we explain that abnormal growth? On a ruins defense device that reacts to anomalies? Maybe. The ruins were veiled in secrecy for too long. We still don't know much about those cursed ruins. Crowd is still growing. We need a solution. Alright, the only direction left, unfortunately, is here. Got to heal. Shit. He did not give us the key. Okay. But will you lead me to a shortcut or a stargazer? He leads to the shortcut. We actually could have ran right past him to get there. But that's fine. We got where we needed. All right. Woo! That was a scary area. I don't even care if you guys kill me. That's fine. Stargazer's right there. Oh. Just in case I fuck it up. I said just in case I fuck it up. Alright. Let's go back and spend this ergo because I really don't want to be running around with all of this because it's just a lot. It took us a lot of effort to get it. And we can deliver this box. Which 
goes to you. The house of Anini, even. Oh, maybe not. The house of Anini. Oh, maybe it goes to you. Those box go. No matter what, sir. Welcome. There he is. This is. I shall open it. No matter what, sir. Welcome. A legion caliber, an alchemical booster, an apple. I don't know what I do with that, but we bought one. I guess. Damage isn't the problem so much as shit freaking hurts. Did we get another half moonstone at any point in all that? We did. Yes, please upgrade it. Pull up to plus eight. So we need three more half moonstones to put up to plus nine, and then we probably I'm just gonna guess it's just a moonstone. Like a complete one is needed to put it up to plus 10 and plus 10 is probably the cap. That's right, we haven't done anything in this for a while. I completely forgot about this as a mechanic. So we can get more healing. Do any of these increase the amount that it heals? I don't really care about the fable slots. I don't care about the dodge. Retain guard regain upon pulse cell. You oh, that's fucking amazing. Okay. An extra amulet. I want like all of these. Increases weapon attack when weapon durability is at maximum. That's terrible, though, because it so quickly falls out of being maximum. Increases attack when pulse cells are discharged. Okay. Enhances the stagger attack of dodge attacks and dash attacks. Perfect guard. That's a good one. this in there mm. dang phase three must be activated I don't know how to activate it Well, I'll go ahead and do this and see if we can equip one that doesn't, um... Did I do this wrong? Maybe. Oh, lol. There's other slots in this bitch. 
there's other categories. I'm like, man, I guess I'll pick this one. Dummy. Oh, hey, there's the thing I was looking for earlier. Legion when killing. Stamina consumption and charge attacks. That's not bad. Charge fable on perfect block. Dash doesn't cost so much stamina. Fable Catalyst, what? Oh, that's good. Don't really want to do that. And now that we're out <laughs> of quartz, I managed to unlock number three. <laughs> What's in here? Shorten fruit bearing time, add another belt slot, increase cube uses, enhance pulse cell recovery. We definitely want this one. But we need another quartz to do it. You can also get an extra pulse cell. Is there anything else in three that's like really good to where I might like want to try and figure out how to get two quartz? Legion arm, fable arts effect, extra perfect guard destruction. That's probably pretty good. Stagger attacks of charge attack. That's pretty good. Okay. What about in here? Weapon durability consumption when weight increases. I don't know what a wish stone is. Naturally recovers durability of inactive weapons. Well, that's neat, but I'm not going to use that. Make shit cheaper. That's cool. Uh, more ergo from killing things. Okay, so there's a few things in here. I don't know if we have change shape. Access save shape memories on the device. Oh, okay. We can shorten our hair back down. Okay. I see. Okay. Let's go see how much quartz is and how much we can get. If we can get... I know there's at least one more piece in there. Let's see if it's one or two that is still able to be purchased. No what, sir, be welcome. Two there, one there. So we can get three... It'll cost a total of 70, no, 6,800. So we need another 4,800 to afford those. We might have that. I haven't used any rainy day stuff in a while. Um, let me make sure that his ass doesn't need any of these. A great weapon. Burnt white kings are go. All Legion Arms ability tier plus one. That's really good. Give me that. Okay, now we don't have to worry about boss Ergo. Come back over here. Bag. 3,000, 4,000. No matter what, sir, welcome. Purchase. Oh, you had two of those? Oh, there's two in stock. I see. Oh, so I need some more then. That's what you're saying. I would need 3,000 more to buy this one. Well, 20... 600 more. I use nine of these as 2700. 
I just want to be no near broke when I do this. Like, after we're done, I want to be almost broke. Figure out how to make the uh, the healing things heal us for more, so that's good. Alright, that gives us more healing and they heal for more. Was there anything else in here that we just really wanted? Cube uses belt slots. No, there's nothing else in here that we really wanted. So we'll just put all three into this one to activate this one. What was the other thing we really wanted? Uh, enemies drop more ergo. Yes. Definitely wanted that one. Do we want destruction of enemies when a perfect guard is successful or more stagger on charge? It's a difficult question. Go with perfect guard destruction. All right. Hey, look, progress. We now have eight heals. The heals heal for more. What a concept, actually engaging with the mechanics of the game. This is why you shouldn't take a break from a game for like f five months. I completely forgot that that was a thing until I saw the quartz in the shop. Stalker. Dude, I want to give you these coins, but I just, I guess I can just dump them into star fragments. I got, I, I don't use this cube thing at all. What does this one do? Restore some HP? Sure. I heard walking. What does this one do? Max stamina. I care about Legion. That one sounds kind of cool. That one's cool too. Or if you're summoning a friend. Oh, that's probably pretty good. A lot of these will help your friend, which is nice. Yeah, there's not one that heals the specter. I mean, this one prevents the specter from dying, which is like close, you know? Creepy tree. Okay. Should be good to proceed now. Meet this lady of cold. Oh no, I'm out of water. I will need to go get some soon. All right, let's fight these dinguses. Goodbye. Good chat. All right, do we think this is the... No, all right. Boss time. That's a short boss run. Kill two idiots. Ergo hearts contain minds with wavelengths. That transparent fullness where lies cannot exist. Is that 
the new true world or a forced prison. Maybe I won't be able to think free, laughing in my head or running <laughs> away. All right, so there's the specter. We won't summon the specter the first time. <gasps> Ow! What's behind door number one? It's a new car. Oh no, it's not. Pinocchio, allow me to introduce you to your future wife, the Lady of Cold. Welcome to my grave. Oh. <laughs> this is where evolution becomes real. I'm sorry, Pinocchio. Pinocchio. Gonna be some death by Snoo Snoo. The champion. I fought a smaller one of you. Fight to the followers of the truth. Okay. What else you got, Victor? What's up, big boy? Ow. That heals a lot more now. Oh, Jesus. Fucking uppercuts, dog. I'm screwed. It takes a while before you're allowed to hurt him again. Oh, yet. Jesus Christ, why? Ow, ow, ow. so bad he's pretty pretty painful but he's not so bad he doesn't take very much damage i think he's going to be the bigger issue for us i don't know if he actually has a second phase we didn't if he did we didn't get to it we'll have to find out oh god damn it oh god these guys if he has a second phase, that might be a little bit more problematic, but right now he's just kind of a big dumb boss that hurts, which is perfectly fine. Gemini. Oh, you were on. Nah, we'll try it again without the Spectre. Open your eyes. Gaze 
Don't let him touch you with that shit. My eyebrow edges. Damn it. the nasty combo victor Oh. Oh. Oh, four hits that time, huh? 50% did trigger a phase two. Which is what? Mr. Bane over here? Gonna pump himself full of a bunch of ergo. Probably. Tried to get around him, but it didn't work. Humanity must be born again. It's their duty and their fate. Man, I feel like I'm cutting into him and I'm just like his life bar is going down so little every time with the slash. It's just like, oh, you're gonna need to do a whole lot more than that. And I'm like, yeah, I can see that. I can see that. You know, a fire grindstone probably... The other grindstone would probably be better. Oh, I can't change shit here. Okay, that's fine. I'll change it later. 
which is probably not electric because he's not a puppet in the normal way. He's kind of fleshy. And Electro is really good against enemies that are more construct. Sure, we'll give it a go with a, with a Spectre. See what that's like. I feel like it's still going to be brutal. Open your eyes. Gaze upon the new world. God damn it. I don't want to be on this fucking staircase, though. It's fucking awful. Like, the Spectre's getting his ass beat because he can't move and neither can the boss, but the boss doesn't give as much of a shit. Hello, Ellie. Oh, my God. when he's like this. Damn it. Let me go. Ow, ow, ow. Fuck. made that immensely easier both from having additional damage and also from the perspective of a slight distraction unless he's got a phase three The Lady of Cold? Vanini? Vanini's evil twin. Yes. I'm surprised you defeated Victor. Geppetto's creations are truly marvelous. Ah, but where are my manners? My name is Simon Manus, a leader among alchemists. I've known your father for a long time. We used to be colleagues, you know. Geppetto didn't understand that the petrification disease can strengthen humankind. Locks into conventional thinking, I'm afraid. 
But even he can't stop such a magnificent discovery. It's the door to a new world. You've seen this place with your own eyes. Truly inspiring, is it not? What do you suppose our cure has created here? Uh, fucking monsters. You're short-sighted, just like your father. But you speak the truth as you see it, just like everyone else. We, on the other hand, are visionaries. We understand the petrification disease on a deeper level. Do you? The disease does not signify death. It's the process of purifying a person's essence. Yeah. A purified human who overcomes the petrification disease will gain a strengthened body and a mind free of lies. You know, it's that second part that I question. The essence is ergo. Yes. The ergo you use as your power was once a human being. Gross. <laughs> Our undertaking is to help others experience this purification through this elixir. Truly, it's an honor. Ergo's power can do even more. In the hands of the awakened, its abilities are limitless. We already have the means to control that power. Power beyond your imagination. So while you wallow in a pathetic past, we step forward into humanity's future on the Isle of Alchemists. You're welcome to come to the island and witness our triumph firsthand. Or perhaps you'll make a futile effort to stop us. <sighs> Maybe the Santa statue can help you. In any case, good luck. Standing against evolution must be exhausting. Not to mention demoralizing. Keep your chin up, puppet. And I'll see you soon. No one can say that Simon Manus, leader of the alchemists, isn't hospitable. Try a gun. You gonna be gone after I come back? Disappear after I walk under you. Whatever, Simon. Now you're gone. Okay. Get out of here. to talk to me will you do um me a favor what's up for once it's not difficult or dangerous just give this to alidoro i'd give it to him myself but he's in the barren swamp now okay he'll understand the significance of this gift i know just do this for me and and i'll be grateful okay Was it you that also wanted to talk? Lady Antonia has heard about the Grand Exhibition. She realizes their cure is meaningless. Her illness has worsened. Perhaps because she lost hope. I fear we might lose her soon. Lady Antonia cautions against it, to be sure. But I still believe that gold coin fruit is our last hope. I have heard about an alchemist who knows how to use that most miraculous of medicines. Please find a way to treat her. If I can. It's not that simple. 
people have no idea so many secrets are buried in Krat. Thanks for keeping me company. All right, so wolf dog man, investigate the piano. Wolf Dog Man is not here. So you met Simon. I've been dreading this conversation. I should have told you about Simon earlier. But it's the sort of thing you have to see to believe. He is the most dangerous man in Krat. He spreads mayhem and death for a delusion he calls evolution. Simon wants to evolve a new world in Krat. A horrible future. Even worse than the carcass monsters we already face. Yeah, they're pretty bad. That's why I woke you up. If you can't save Krat from Simon, no one can. Find the Isle of Alchemists. Someone must know how to get there. Yeah, there's a boat. I will help as much as I can, of course. Please, save Krat. Whatever choice you make. Whatever choice you make, I shall wait for you. That is why I'm the listener. To bear witness. Okay. Um, we get one level, and if we spend 1300 rainy day, we can get another level. So let's spend that now. We'll just make it fourteen hundred. Whatever choice. Okay, while this ninety second ad break runs, I'm gonna run to the bathroom. How close are we to? I know my way around away. Oh, we need four. Suck. It's a lot. Okay. Oh, uh, we can craft another one of these, right?
Curious how this works. I think we can get a one Legion caliber out of the shop to fully upgrade our arm. No matter what, serving her welcome. Yeah, it costs three thousand. Quite a bit. We have that in. Yeah, we do. I'm gonna go ahead and get it. No matter what, serving welcome. Then I want to try and figure out how it works. And our arm is fully upgraded. It has to be charged, okay. Lol. Do we use it again? Is that how we do the counter? Damn. How do we, do I need to hold it? Lol. You may need to hold it. Do I need to hit it again? Fuck. It's very precise. Damn. That's it. Now, the next question is, is it only on the parry or is it on activation at all? He's gonna do the big one. Activation. Looks like it's only on the parry. Let me double check. It does only cost one legion no matter what so all right very nice very nice tally fourth man it took us like three hours to get to that boss and i don't even feel like we were struggling i feel like it was just a long way to get to him It seems you and I share a strong connection. Ugh. Talking to an alchemist is like talking to a brick wall. That's also an alchemist. Brother, you should say hello to your friend. But it is true that we are in something of a bind. We're going to need to consult with our old friend. You got that right, sister. Our pal is sure to help us. 
We didn't behave that badly at his last shindig. I hope. A moment, please. My young brother here is slowly but surely losing his very sight, his windows to the world, to a terrible, slow-working illness. That is why I seek the gold coin fruit. It's set to work miracles, and do I ever need one. The alchemists give us just enough to keep him going, but not enough to cure, and never what they promised. We can't rely on those crucible-kissing wizards. Please, don't make me beg. He needs this. Besides, for a fellow who raided the Black Rabbit Brotherhood's den and walked out in one piece, it'll be as easy as eating your weight in bumbaloni. Please, the gold coin fruit is the only thing that helps. Uh, are you there? C can you hear me? Please, the gold... <gasps> we knew you were a true friend. ...and generous. <laughs> That's right. I liked you from the start, you know. Just had a feeling. If you felt otherwise, that wasn't me. <laughs> Ignore this one. When he gets excited or just feels happy, he gets chatty. But he really is grateful. We both are. On that note, I hate to borrow and run, but we have another request from the Alchemist to take care of, so we will be staying behind. You'll need to go on without us, so... I suppose this is farewell. I won't ever forget your kindness. Here, a small token, but it's a gift from the heart. Now go. Thanks. Wow! Uh, you need me? I was surprised when the bell rang. The Isle of Alchemists, you say? And monsters. This is a nightmare. I'm living my own nightmare. Puppets and alchemists forget it. It is their secret island. A place hidden from the world. But even if we could find it, how to get there? There's a boat in an underground dock. They told us. Puppets everywhere. gonna go back to the hotel real quick Geppetto wants to talk you want Geppetto um, both to talk to Geppetto apparently and also to play that record because we were given a record and every time we play a record we 
gain more humanity, and I don't know what that means necessarily, but we did get another record. is a change I didn't expect. My hair growing? Did the King of Puppets get you? Or some other ruffians? No. I'm glad you're growing. But I'm not sure what to make of this. Be wary of dangerous people. And always be a good boy for me. Why you gotta say it that way? I want to believe at a certain point that this nose can just like extend across the room if you're dedicated enough to it. Just like knocks these books over. You get a little bit taller and you fucking bump your head on it every time you come in the room. Pretty song. Yeah, that was cool. Don't know what that means still, but you know. All right. We got to give the glove to Wolf Dog Man. Abelard or Abel Adaloro. Abelor. Whatever. He's here somewhere. This place is... Okay, there's no easy way to say this, but it's a puppet graveyard. Yeah, no kidding. Humans call it an illegal dumping site. The city tried to stop it, but eventually had much bigger concerns. Yeah, like this guy? With the Grand Exhibition's horrific solutions for this part, too. I think it's just too terrible to think about. Fuck. Oh, why am I thinking about it? Oh, stop it. Please. You know, I was trying to like parry that. It wasn't working. Damn. Damn. Maybe I can't parry that. Maybe he's just too big and strong. 
I was like, I'm gonna try and parry it because I have this new parry mechanic and you know what didn't work? The parry mechanic. <laughs> it's like, well, you gotta not suck, bro. Fucking do it again. Damn. Well, it did work that time. Pain. So much fire. Fire, fire, fire. Ow. Why did your head look like it was going to explode? Why does that look like it's going to explode? Why does it look like I could fall off this and die? I just realized my shield is empty. Oh! Can't quite poke through the box. Got a new one of these, yeah. Is it any good? Reduces electric damage a lot, but reduces fire resistance. But that one dude was all covered in fire. I mean, I'll put it on on the idea that they're giving me the thing that I need to use, but if I see another one of those big dudes that's on fire, I'm switching off of it. Rude. Fuck off. Well, I don't know what corruption is. I'm, I don't think I really want to find out either. Oh, it drains real slow. That sucks for us. Ow. There's an item back there, but I don't want to get it right now. What the fuck? Wait a minute, is that the same clown? He's just on fucking fire. Uh, he's just electric now. A significantly worse arena than we had last time.
God damn it. fight him again he's real awful oh he had a better arena up where he was dude fuck you Something big. It's another flame guy. up here. I'll I'll go down to the flame guy in a minute, but I would like to find one of two things, either another stargazer or a shortcut back to the first one. Especially because I don't want to refight the freaking clown. Nope. Fucking bloodborne hunter ass looking motherfucker with a flaming sword. No. I'm gonna go down here first and see what my elf eyes see. There's dog man. Way back to the first stargazer. Perfect. Those damn alchemists. Hey, Roji. Bargain. Almost intolerable. Well, it's not like I care about those hotel people. How are you, Roji? That was but a shit are, roller coaster. It's... What was? <clears throat> How do you do? It's quite odd that we should meet in a place like this. Oh, don't pretend surprised that I got here before you. After all, I can elude the darkest monsters, the loftiest beings. In fairness, I do benefit from your prowess as well. I shall tell you something since we're nearly peers. They say a terrible monster lives on the cliff at the end of the swamp. It behaves like a crow gathering shiny things. I have absconded with treasures from its lair, rare parts and weapons worthy of a hero. Yeah. Now catch your interest? If you're hunting ergo monsters, you might put that friendly tip to use. You're a worthy hunter, and it is worthy prey. Show that swamp monster what you're capable of. Got it. You're a worthy hunter, and it is worthy Here's some gloves. What's this? A gift for a rescuer. 
From a technician girl? Hmm, I don't remember. I've saved so many of the common people. <laughs> anyway, uh, thank her, I suppose. Oh. <coughs> oh, dear. These gloves are a mess. They don't even fit. Is this a practical joke? <sighs> My God, I never did like that girl. She's just like him. Oh, <coughs> never mind. I thought you had better taste than this. How disappointing. Get these rags out of my sight. You're a worthy hunter. And it okay. Hi, Cindy. How's it going? You're okay, you guys, Rochi? How am I? I'm doing all right. I'm doing pretty good. This game's abusive. Temporarily increases physical damage upon a successful attack. So the more you hit shit, the better it is. I did choose that and this... <laughs> Fucking really cool looking greatsword. Frozen feast. That said, I don't expect to use another weapon, but I'll just wait to use this. Minecart went about 300 feet and exploded. It sure did, but it opened up the door that I needed it to open. We're doing really well, Cinny. Trying to walk, imagine them walking down a hallway with that large weapon. I mean, you know... I'm sure it's fine. Just scratches the shit out of the walls all over the place. Switch grindstone of grinder. That's what I need. Let's change it to... Acid. Because the enemies here do electric and fire. So we'll pick the other one. We'll, we'll grab acid damage. Stay in there. What have you been up to, Sinister? Sinister? Think there's any chance I can backstab this dude? I feel like the answer is no, but I'm gonna try anyway. I hit the wrong fucking button. I'm a genius. That was weird. Oh my god. Oh, ow. So mean. A recharged amulet. Hmm. Ow, that hurt. We're fine. What does it do? Restores HP continuously. If that does what it says it does, that's amazing. It's like my refrigerator temperature IQ four ball. She gouged out the walls climbing into the windowsill because cat too dumb to jump. That tracks. This nerd is on fire. Wait a minute. So that dude is there. 
What's in the base of the tower? Because there's another fire dude in the base of the tower. And I don't know where that leads down there. So one way to find out. Come here. You about finished. So there is a ladder that just leads down here. That's good. What are you guarding? A couple of items? Come here. Come here. You asshole. The game never lets you plunge attack anything. Thank you. Okay. Well, that was exciting. That thing just flame shard itself? It did. It absolutely did. It does it all the time. We have enough ergo for a level, but I'm going to go forward some more and see what what's next. Oh, almost assuredly, Rochi. There's going to be more assholes. Unquestionably. How many? What kind? Does one of them have a big shiny health bar? I hope so. trap there. Another one there. Interesting. Excuse the fuck out of you. Hmm. 
<laughs> the fuck that thing know where you are with no head? Uh, probably because of, uh, ergo. The, like, life energy that powers puppets. You guys are real slow. Ow. Ow. Oh God, it wasn't hitting me before. Ew. Double, triple, quadruple, ew. Then a lead over there that's all electrified. And to get back, I'd have to go through a bunch of corrupted no-no. Stop it! fine we're fine everything's fine no need to be concerned you stop it why why can't i just use it Whatever. Is it just broken forever now? Because that'd be great. I'm gonna insult the dude before slicing into him five times? Yeah, insult to injury or however that's supposed to work, right? What is this? The green monster is cleverer than you think. It likes to collect puppet bodies, but for what for? The green monster? What green monster? I don't like the sound of that. Oi, you, big, dumb, and ugly. Hey, Don't fucking ignore me. Come here. That did not work out how I wanted. I wanted him to hit the barrels and blow up. And instead, apparently, if I so much as bump a barrel, it blows up. So, lesson, lesson learned. That sucks a lot, but that's fine. It's like, yeah, no big deal. We'll just get him to get some more damage on him. I was wrong. See that doggie up there? It's my little baby doggie. Wakey, wakey. Let's play. Hey. Hey, guy. Ow. 
All right. Thankfully, that thing does stay broken. Was that a dog with two asses? I mean, fucking probably. Oh, oh no. We can't be almost dying. Excuse me if you would. Thank you. Cause uh, I need this. Ow. Uh oh. I'm gonna leave all you in there. Yeah, I heard you whistle. Ow. Oh, God. weapon Dang. damn climbing on this is hard Stop trying to parry that shit. Like before I fuck it up and die. Okay. I don't know what happens if that corruption bar fills up, but admittedly, I don't really want to find out either. Get out of the water. gamer are you if you ain't rolling in a bunch of poo juice you know what i really ow oh god Be gone. I'm not touching that. Not yet. Activate this stargazer first. Now we'll touch this. Wow. So they do exist. Other puppets like me not bound by the Grand Covenant. That's not what I was expecting. I thought I was forever alone. Without the Covenant, my kind hates me. Monstrous humans, puppets, they all hate me. But I want to be friends with humans. If I learn how to feel, would that be possible? 
If you tell me how, I'll return the favor. I want to learn how to feel. I'm sure there's no way this will end poorly. Hello, my only friend. Ref. What have you come to tell me? Uh, teach how to clap. Clapping is uh, the mimicry of a joyful heart. It's good to feel alive. <laughs> Thanks. Hello, my only friend. Ref. What have you come to tell me? I'll be back. Okay, now we have like two levels or really close to two levels. And I think there's a boss right up the uh, the little way there. So we will go uh, level. Uh, apparently we need to talk to Geppetto and to Eugenie. But I think that big stompy sound I hear is another boss. Hey, uh, guy hated your fucking gift. Hey, about my request last time. Did you give Ali Dodo the gloves? They did. Phew. Even the union's advancement test didn't make me this nervous. All right, I'm ready. Tell me the truth. Okay. Did the gloves make Ali Dodo happy? No. He was angry. He said they were rubbish. What? His fingers are fine? That can't be right. And no, I'm not being precious about my work. When the workshop tower collapsed, the Hound lost a finger saving me. Something to puzzle over. In any case, thanks for doing your part. You have a moment to... I know I sound obsessed, but... When the workshop tower collapsed, he saved me. We could have starved to death trapped under the rubble. If it wasn't for Ali Doro's sacrifice back then, I don't want to think about it. And yet I can't forget it. That's why it's so puzzling. It's not like his finger could grow back. He's never taken the mask off. Find out more about Ali Doro for me? If I called it surveillance, would that be too cruel? I think that's cruel. In any case, we need to watch out. You be careful too. Yeah. Oh, um, I know my way around. I actually want to. I'm halfway there. I need two more. Okay. Geppetto! You. Uh, I'm glad you're here, my son. Have you seen that painting? Yeah, my nose is growing. I can't believe my eyes. It's almost as if something is growing out of the portrait. I remember commissioning that piece from an artist named D. Gray. Like huh. all artists, he was eccentric. He claimed that a painting could harbor a living soul. But how can that happen? Just like the fairy tale. Forgive a foolish man his ramblings. Perhaps the seed of its growth was there all along. I know you're curious, so see for yourself. I have my work to keep me busy. D. Gray, Dorian Gray. Yeah, I don't know how much this nose grows every time we lies, but you know, I think we've owned We've only truly lied once that we are confident that was it was a lie, and that was to get into the hotel. The game makes you lie at the very beginning. Beyond that, though, we've been fairly truthful. The only other two decisions were things that were subjective or that we didn't have enough answer uh, information to give a clear answer on. Oh, she has things to say. Ask about listener. I've always wondered why I'm a listener. Why this power came to me in this time and place. But now I understand. Ergo reached out. 
wanting someone to hear it was once human. Or maybe it wanted someone to remember it. Perhaps a god or an angel. Who knows? But the alchemists have tainted everything. The gold coin tree is a pathetic creature they created from the listeners. Yeah, that sounds about right. Like many of their creations, it's tragic, but useful. You can control Ergo with gold coin fruits. The sad tears of those who became trees. If they get the chance, the alchemists might force me to make such a tree for them. Or something even more tragic. Yeah, they might make you Don't into a the tree. Sacrifice of the alchemists' victims be in vain. With the fruit, they lend their strength to you. Collect gold coin fruits, and let the Saintess statue inspire you to victory. You honor their sacrifice, their grief, and tears. Petrification disease, puppet frenzy and carcass monsters don't happen by chance. They're all related to Ergo. Ergo is the essence of life made from the petrification disease. It contains the memories and distilled lifespan of the victim. That's why puppets sometimes awaken their old selves or describe someone else's memories. Simon coveted Ergo's power and he noticed that the process of curing the petrification disease could also create enhanced humans. Krat became a city of monsters and petrification disease because of Simon's terrible experiments. The King of Puppets tried to stop Simon, but he didn't do well either. Now, our only hope is you. Save Krat. From this nightmare. Okay. We've leveled up. We shall know. Probably go fight a big beastie. Big crow thing. We never did find the woman of cold, did we? She might still be further ahead. Person that the riddle master talked about. Another one here? Must be. Can't get inside for this one. Dang. Have to get in from the backside. Looks like corruption slowly eats away at our HP. Taken over the post, but where are the rocks when entering the ravine? Hmm. This didn't quite lead where I hoped. Here. 
more butterflies. Butterfly did get blasted, which is nice. Thanks for helping, buddy. Jesus. break surprisingly no it's what's underneath what's up dude ah, this must be quite an urgent patient to seek out my humble abode you are still breathing I must treat you quickly Grant cannot have any more live patients Trust me, it's better this way. Tis far nobler to die as a human. My guy. No vital signs. You must be dead. I'll dispose of you properly. Ow! Fuck you. What was her name? You finished? I remember now. My Adelina. Oh, his hand got stuck in the wall. All right, well. I am not number 890. Name, precious, forgotten. All right, well, found a random boss. Boss. Cough. Well, that makes me feel a little better. Um, I knew that starting this room, we had 11 bosses left. And I was like, admittedly going to be a little disappointed if we only got one. Because it took us so long to get to Victor. And it wasn't... Oh, God. And it wasn't even because he would, like he was insanely difficult. It just took forever to get to him. That opens from the other side. Ew, hate that. Fuck. Yeah, that's about what I thought. I was like, I don't think I can make that roll. I was right. 
see you there. My controller has a, a button sticking a little bit, and that's really annoying. The right trigger is catching just a little bit. Don't like that. It's a lovely room of death. So many places to fall and die. Some time. Dude, get up here. Ew! I'm all covered in mud. It's hard to move. jerk just don't bump the barrels those are really that useful anymore they upgrade our legion arm but i don't know if we're going to be ever upgrading our legion arm again because where you got the shield and the shield's maxed out well, we can drop down on top of that i'm not going to right this minute oh really okay well i'm glad i came this way very surprising still know how to get up there let me go make sure there's not something back here real quick Hey, Brenny, thank you for the lurk. Require a way up. Oh, Jesus, I didn't move far enough out of the way. Require a way up there. Because I think those two areas are connected. Damn it. All right. Excuse the fuck out of me. Sorry for investigating. Well, there's a cave there. If we go over here, there's a cave over here. So maybe it circles all the way around. Right next to that fire, there's a cave mouth. Where'd that fucking go?
Oh, jeez. Where'd you even come from? Wait a minute. Here we go. Sweet. We can upgrade our weapon now. That's four half moon stones, so we can put it up to plus nine. shortcut past all of the fucking fireballs fireball hi i'll take obviously dangerous doors for 600 alex It's a bear. Okay, got the bear. Okay. That way. I was like, where are we actually supposed to go next? Back this way. Which hopefully will lead us to that tower to turn off the... Hi. No. No, 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 no. Shield is empty. Ow. Ow. 
Ow. All right, there's our way into the tower, but it is approaching 8.30 here, so I will unfortunately need to stop at that point. But we're going to go spend this level first, and then this is what we'll pick up tomorrow. The next boss can't be too much farther down that way. This crow that they're talking about that likes to use puppet parts. We should be back tomorrow as just a heads up of... Oh... Geppetto wants something. Geppetto, what do you want now? Ask me about Eric. We already had this talk. You don't remember. Ask me about it. What? But it said he wanted to talk. Was I looking at the wrong person? Is it you that actually wants to talk? People have no idea, so thanks for keeping me come. Nope. Said it was Geppetto. But. Whatever choice you make. Alright, well, whatever. whatever. Choice. Um. I don't know at this point. More damage. Okay. And with that, let's go figure out where we're going. So just as a heads up, everybody, my incredible partner in life and my wife, Athena Latina, is going to be streaming uh, very shortly after I'm done, probably here in the next... 40 minutes, I would say, probably around on the hour is when you can expect that to happen. Um, obviously, I can't raid my own wife, unfortunately. That would be really sweet if I could, but I can't. So instead, we're going to go raid Minimal Gameplay uh, because Minimal is fantastic and wonderful. I should be live again tomorrow. Why didn't I? Why didn't the shout out go through? I should be live again tomorrow, um, but you can also go ahead and follow me on social media. I'm on tw YouTube. I got YouTube videos going up all the time. Twitter threads, Blue Sky, Instagram, whatever you see fit for you. We're going to go raid one minimal gameplay. This is the raid message. If you're not a subscriber, you can unlock that raid swan for 100 channel points. Uh, and when you do so, it's available to you for the next 24 hours. And it lets you use it on other people's channels, which means that you can use it on the raid. So we're going to go raid minimal. I appreciate you, everybody. I will see you either in Athena's stream later or back here tomorrow. Thank you so much. See you next time.